Zach here with Secrets of Longevity in Humans.com. It's Friday, August 28th, 2009, and it is the last full day of my stay here at the Hippocrates Health Institute, so I guess it's day six or something. Totally lost track, that doesn't matter. Um, just graduated, and we had a big uh, sort of ceremony where everyone went up and had got given their certificate and their final tests and they got to speak about their stay here and to get their experience and how they felt and give their thanks to everyone here. Wonderful, wonderful um, event put on by Brian and Anna Maria, Maria Clement and I was just absolutely perhaps one of the most moving um, things here at the Institute is the final graduation. Uh, you get to see the transformation in people's lives, how their attitude has shifted about their diseases and their health and their overall appreciation for life. It's, uh, there are some really incredible uh, stories that people had to tell, some very emotional stories as well. And I'm out here outside in the rain. Oh, it's actually just the tail end of the storm that just hit here. I guess it was like a tropical storm or something. The tail end of it is raining pretty hard here, but it's just lush and green, so I had to do one of my last videos out here. So, I am thoroughly satisfied with having came here. I want to finish up with some, a few testimonials, one or two, or however many I get from some friends here who are willing to share that with you. Um, yeah, so here they are. I'm here with a good friend of mine who just wants to share her experience in the past three weeks here at Hippocrates. So, how have you found it so far? Isaac, it's been an amazing, awesome, awesome experience. Yeah. It's been life transforming, uh, in addition to making really great friends such yeah. as with you. Um, I came here to work on one issue, and I found that, you know, I, I've deeply transformed my life and yeah. who I am. And the illness that I came to work on, I know is no longer going to be. Yeah. And I am so incredibly grateful. Yeah. So, and I had a ball. I had a ball. And yeah. the food is delicious. The food is awesome. That's fantastic. And you've been here twice before. I've been here a couple before. times, yes. The first time I came, I, I healed, uh, it was my turning point in healing Lyme disease. Yeah. And then I came for a little tuna at Thanksgiving. Nice. So, it's been, it's a place I will continue to come back to. Yeah, it seems like most people do. Thank you. You're welcome. See you later. I'm here with Juniper and Amber once again, and they want to share their experiences as well. So guys, how have you enjoyed the last three weeks? The raw food um, was one thing. I mean, it's delicious in the beginning, maybe not so, but um, it grows on you. And um, the juices and the regularity of um, the week was the juices, um, the support of the team the people who uh, back us up, uh, that helps to smooth us through the ups and downs of these three weeks and uh, all in all I had an amazing experience, met yeah. fantastic people and um, uh, make friends for life. Um, we leave here with a lot of positive intentions, really good intentions with a clear mind and lots less, lots, lots less disease. Nice. And Juniper? How's your time here? <laughs> it, is, um, it is raw food, raw love. That's how I call <laughs> this place. So I think that um, the raw food based diet really creates an inner alignment that is um, it really reconnected me a lot with the joy of living. Yeah. So I think it's a life giving program although and I think that the ex it, it's very nurturing. This nutrition is very nurturing, but also the environment here, the guests and the staff and everyone is just like completely an ongoing manifestation of pure, unconditional love. And so, if you want to recharge your love batteries and tune up your health, physical, emotional, and spiritual. 
get on an airplane to West Palm Beach. Nice. Hippocrates. <laughs> <laughs> what, what do you guys feel like you're going to, like when you leave here, do you feel like comfortable going back out into the world and continuing more or less this program? Do you feel like you've reached a place where you're going to be able to do that? Well, uh, truth will tell, right? Um, but I do feel, you know, staying three weeks, at first I was going to stay one, and then I realized how I was gaining back mental clarity and other things that I had lost with my uh, yeast infection, which now it's gone. Um, but staying three weeks really has helped me to see so much the benefits of the program that I feel empowered. I mean, I'm lucky that I'm living in a place that has a lot of resources, so I think it will be quite possible. You know, yeah. uh, to, I don't know if I will be 100% raw, but I don't have to because now I'm healthy as an ox, they said, so I can be 80 20. But um, even 80% raw will be a great achievement for me, and I think that. Um, it is feasible, you know, it will require adjustment and commitment, and if I'm not doing it all at once, I'll come back for a two-half. Nice. Uh, yeah, and um, I've tried a lot of different diets to uh, maximize my energy before, and uh, the, the food we eat here is very simple, although uh, there's a large packet uh, every day. As you detox the food, the simpler food tastes better than better. And um, you get more energy from it, so I had really no choice in life as yeah. to follow this program. Tricky it becomes when I travel, obviously, yeah. because uh, then I have to outsource, I have to become a hunter again. <laughs> I'm a woman, so it's not really my job, but um, I multitask, it is my job as a woman, so. Uh, Definitely, I'm going to do my best to stay raw and disease free. Excellent. Thank you both so much. I really appreciate it. Thank you, Zach. Thank you really Zach. added a lot to the <laughs> experience. <laughs> Hi, we're here with Donald Luke from New York City. And uh, Donald, how, how has your stay been here the last three weeks? Uh, I've, I have been here for three weeks, that's correct. This is my last day, and as, as you can see, um, in the assault pool right now, the mineral uh, pool. Yeah. I, I had a wonderful time. Uh, it's just a great experience, educational. I'm a meat and potatoes guy, a lot of meat, and uh, the education I got here has really made me think twice about what I'm putting into my body. Yeah. The processed foods, the way it's all produced. Uh, I came here because I have cancer of the kidney. They took out my kidney last September. The cancer came back to my spine, my. Uh, uh, pelvis and my um, uh, rib. So I came back to find another way because I really don't want to do the chemotherapy. And yeah. I have to tell you, tell you, I've heard some positive, positive stories here from a lot of different people that are just visiting the place and, and how they've had family members that have uh, overcome their, their cancers or their uh, diabetes from this particular diet. So I'm pretty excited about it. Um, I hope I could do it. Uh, but it was just a wonderful stay. Massages, acupuncture, uh, neural muscular massages, um, crystal crystal therapy. Uh, it's just been great. H wave. Everything has been wonderful. The staff are wonderful, and hanging out with Zach's been great too. <laughs> cool. All right. Any other questions? Yeah. I just. How, how are you feeling now at the end of the three weeks? Do you think you're, when you go home, are you going to be able to continue this to, like? From what you learned here, are you going to be able to, wow, it's really starting to come down. Well, fortunately, uh, my wife was here with me for the first week, yeah. and um, she's back home already, and she's been home for two weeks eating raw. And Fantastic. We bought, we bought some of the equipment that we need to, to, uh, to sprout and to blend and to process and to make ice cream, my favorite. I think that's going to be my favorite treat here. We make a nut ice cream. It's made out of um, uh, pine nuts and almond nuts, and we add some... Uh, Stevia, which is a plant-based uh, sweetener, yeah. no problem for cancer patients. And I think I'm gonna, you know, I don't know. You know I did cheat a couple times while I was here, but that's think, okay. Yeah, I think at home I'm really gonna go for it. Um, yeah. It's been told to me that 100 percent of the people that have followed this diet, 100 percent of the time or this lifestyle, 100 percent 
have been cured of their illnesses. So they cure themselves, yeah, that's they exactly cure it. Themselves. And uh, I'm pretty excited about it. I'm loving the pool in the rain. <laughs> it's pretty uh I'm singing in amazing. the rain. Awesome. Well, I'm gonna have to at some point come down to New York and we'll have to have a follow-up interview to see how you're doing. Oh absolutely. Come down anytime. I can reach from any of you people out there at 866 Call me anytime. Well, my cell phone number nine one seven eight four six two six six six. Call me anytime. Awesome. Okay, they will if they need uh if they need uh, any questions on doctors. Awesome. Thank you, Donald. You're welcome.